Hello, welcome to EKG Rhythms video blog. In this video, I will show you how to compute for the rate. This could either be computing for the ventricular rate or atrial rate. There are three ways to compute for the rate. Big box method, the small box method, and the six second method. This is a typical two lead strip showing lead two on top and the V lead below. Now what is the rate? The big box method. The rate is computed by the R to R interval for ventricular rate or P to P interval for the atrial rate. Based on the big boxes it will fit. The RR interval of one big box is equal to 300 beats per minute. The RR interval of two big boxes is equal to 150 beats per minute and down the line. The R to R is highlighted with blue arrows and it is about two big boxes. And the red arrows highlight the iterate rate which is about one big box. So we will bring in our big box and check the rate. The ventricular rate is about 150 beats per minute and the atrial rate is about 300 beats per minute. Next is the small square method. The rate is computed using the formula 1500 divided by the number of small squares inside the R to R. For the ventricular rate, there are 10 small squares in this RR interval. So 1500 divided by 10 is equal to 150 beats per minute. For the atrial rate, there are 5 small squares in a PP interval. So the rate is 1500 divided by 5 equal to 300, 300 beats per minute. The next is the 6 second method. In a 2 lead strip, there are small, li two, there are small lines at the bottom which I highlighted with red arrows. You can see these lines in your typical two lead strip printout. These lines represent three seconds interval. For the six second method, you count the number of R waves if you are computing for the ventricular rate or P waves if you are computing for the atrial rate inside the six second strip. You then multiply the number of R or P waves by 10. Remember, the multiplier is 10, then you get the rate. So in this case, there are 13 small squares. So the rate is 130 bits per minute. Now in summary, there are three methods you can use to calculate the rate. The big box, the small box, and the six second method. It is easy to use and remember. Thank you for watching the blog and please follow EKG Rhythms.